Girls. For today's video, I'm doing a bikini lookbook, a bikini try-on haul. I don't really know what I'm going to title it yet. The reason why I kind of want to name it bikini lookbook is because these bikinis I'm about to show you are the ones that I really feel like I would mainly wear. These bikinis are honestly like my new favorite. Like this brand is my new favorite bikini brand. So that's why I'm so excited to do this try-on haul because these bikinis make your body look so good. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you want to. I'm literally so excited to do this try-on. I don't know why, I just know you guys are gonna love these. The brand that sent me these bikinis are called Black Bow. Black Bow Swimwear, I believe. And I could already tell from the pictures that I was gonna really like them, but I really just didn't expect to like them this much. So yeah, enough talking. Let's just get started with the video. Okay, so... This is the first one. This was the one I was wearing in the intro. Tell me this is not the cutest bikini you've ever seen. Like, I feel like a freaking Barbie. Just normal type of top. There's actually like no padding in here. And it has a little zipper. You can keep it like zipped. I just think it's cuter like when it's kind of unzipped. And the color, what are we gonna say about the color, guys? How do we feel about the color? Because I really love it. I give the color a 10 out of 10, 100%. I give the bathing suit a 10 out of 10, 100%. I just feel cute. I feel like a baddie. I would wear this to the beach. I would wear this to a pool party. Party. Literally anywhere. I would wear this to anything with water where I need a swimsuit. It really accentuates my hips, which I really like because I have hip dips. I have those little indentions right here. But I think they're cute, so I like to kind of show them off but make them look good, you know? And I feel like this does this for me. I'm just really feeling this one. This one's probably like my favorite. This is what the back looks like. And the back is honestly really showy, but I like it. Like I would still wear it because I feel like it flatters me. And I don't even know if the camera is picking up how bright this bikini is. Like it's literally highlighter pink, literally. Rate my bikinis down below from least to best or best to worst or whatever you want. Just so I can know your opinions on the bikinis too. Also another plus of this bikini and really of the color is it's gonna make you look tanner, you know? So if you kind of want more of a tan, and you want to accentuate it, then this is a really good color for that. Okay, so this is the second one. This one I'm insanely obsessed with. Like the color! How did these people pick the most perfect colors? And they called it shark gray, which should be a trend now. Like, can we get that started? But now I went to a pool party the other day and I was thinking about wearing this one. I couldn't because it kind of looks weird under any shirts because of the knot right here. But if you just wear it by itself, it's adorable. To me, this bikini is like two words. Like two words come to mind. And those are elegant and sexy. <laughs> Which are like the two best ones sometimes, you know? And again, the bottoms are really, really flattering. They're really cute. They make you look your best. And to me, the top is perfect too because I've had tops where they tie and they're supposed to do this thing where they kind of wrap around your boob and then come in. And they usually don't. Like, it just never really works for me. So the fact that this one actually did, like, I'm just so happy I finally found one. <laughs> oh, by the way, guys, I'm a small in all the bikinis. I'm showing you top and bottom. And it's a one strap. Like, how much cuter? And imagine if, like, I had a really good tan. Like, right now, I have a tan, but just a little bit. But imagine, like, when I'm at my full peak of tanness. This is what the bottom looks like. They're that type that's, like, very cheeky. Like, they kind of look like the Victoria's Secret cheekster ones. Do you remember those underwear? Those used to be my favorite ones, and I would buy them all the time. I'm gonna, like, have a little photo shoot in this. Like, I'm gonna curl my hair and do my makeup. And I don't know if you guys have noticed, but on every one of the bottoms, there's a little black bow. <laughs> what would you even call this? It's their logo, but I forget what this thing's actually called. Whatever it's called, I really like that. I think it adds a really cute touch, and it kind of makes it look just a tad bit more luxurious in a way. This is the third one. This one I fell in love with because I love stripes. I don't express my love for them that much, but I really do appreciate them. This bralette thing came with no padding in it, but it came with padding though, so I put it in and I'm not sure if I like it. I think I'm gonna take them out really quick. Okay, does that look any different? Not even, no. <laughs> I mean, I look like I have no boobs, but in a cute way. I feel like I look petite in this area like that's the word but no i really do love this bikini i would wear this to the beach specifically it just looks like a beachy bikini to me and honestly i didn't even mean to get these bottoms i ordered these bottoms in this pattern but in the style of the last two bikinis that i just tried on but i ended up getting these i'm kind of happy i did because i've had this cut before where it's like i think it's called the high leg 
because it like goes really high up on your leg. And I feel like they did a really good job of this because I've had this cut and it'll just make the front and even sometimes the back just look really weird. If it's not done like perfectly, it's gonna look wonky. Or at least that's how I feel it looks on me sometimes. But this one really hugs the top of you and it hugs the bottom of you too. Like this one's not budging. But yeah, again, it's really flattering. Like I can't stress that enough. That's my favorite thing about bikinis. So I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself a lot, but it's just that I never really find a lot of bikinis that I feel like are 100% flattering, you know? But literally every single one of these bikinis I'm trying on, like I'm in love with. This is what the back looks like. I really like the whole three line, like three, what, what would you say? Strap type of thing going around my back. And of course, I feel like my butt looks good. I feel literally beautiful right now. The first three have hit a 10 out of 10 for me. If there's a nine or eight, I'll let you know. This may be a nine. Actually, no, it's still a 10. It's just a different cut, you know, but for the cut, it's a 10. I'm really vibing with this one. But anyways, on to the next one. This. Is the fourth one, I think. This is another one that just makes me feel like a freaking Barbie. And if you didn't know, that's like my whole thing. Like, <laughs> I love that. I can't even tell you how soft and stretchy and comfortable these bikinis are too. This is just a bikini where it's almost like a bra and panty. Like it kind of looks like that, which I really, really like. It's one of my favorite types of styles of bikinis is when they look simple like this. And the color is a different type of pink, but somehow it's almost just as bright and like just as cute to me. At first I was a little iffy about this one. I don't know why. I saw it on the model online and like I was just kind of iffy, but I literally couldn't have made a better decision What I think about this one is either a pool party or just going to the pool period Like I have a pool in my apartments and I feel like I would wear this there even though they are cheeky You know, I it's 2019. I'm gonna wear cheeky bikinis wherever the hell I want unless there's kids If there's kids I won't <laughs> This is what the bottom looks like Or not the bottom the behind. And there's no padding in this, and I usually say this in my bikini try-ons, but I don't really like padding in a lot of my bikinis. I like them in some. So this one's perfect because there's no padding, but yet there's lift and there's an underwire. I really like underwires in bikinis. I want to literally like wear this to like a pageant and this be like the bikini that I choose to walk out during the bikini part, you know? <laughs> I've never been in a pageant, but like if I could, this would be what I would have in mind. At least this cut because Again, it's flattering as shit. Come on. <laughs> This is the bikini that the brand wanted me to try on, so they picked this one out for me. And I honestly think it's beautiful. Like, it's like this pink, rosy pink velvet, you know, it's cute. And the bottoms are just as cute, and they have the little um logo on the, <laughs> the top of the butt, which I think is adorable. Like, they're furry, the little things that tie, they're soft. But the bottoms, they're so low. Why do you want me to show this much? Look where they end. That's, that's where they start. If I have to crop it out, I'll crop it out. But literally, I feel like my vagina is about to show. And I just like tan today. So you can kind of see like my tan life. <laughs> this is just so weird. I mean, it's really cute. I'm gonna wear it somewhere, you know what I'm saying? But it's like just so funny to me. I don't know why it's so low like that. I mean, I guess I could have got a medium, but all the other smalls fit. So I thought this one would like fit too. <laughs> this is the backside of this one. I really love the color of this one, to be honest. And it's kind of sporty. It definitely gives you like kind of an hourglass shape too. I'm gonna give this one a 10 out of 10 for the pick. I think whoever picked out this bathing suit for me did a really good job actually. And they kept in mind that I love pink and they kept in mind my skin tone because I feel like this really complements that. Well, I feel like it would compliment almost anybody's maybe, but I just really like it on my tan. And it's super girly. It's velvet too. I don't know if you could tell or if I mentioned that, but I really like it. It's really keeping you in. Like you're not even gonna have any nipple showing in this. Oh, by the way, this is the second to the last one. The last one is next. But yeah, tell me how you guys feel about this bikini down in the comments. I've never seen anything like this bikini, to be honest with you, but I really dig it. <sighs> we really saved a good one for last. This has got to be one of the best ones. This might beat the first one, to be honest. And what I really want to talk about with this one is the color. Because it's not just red. It's like this orangey, like hot pepper red. <laughs> Zion said it looks like a hot chili pepper or something. And I completely agree. I really, really love the color. I dig it. It's the best red I've ever seen on me. It's crazy. The bottoms are like pretty much either the same cut or style or at least the same feel, I guess, as the second one. Maybe not the first, but the second one. This one I would wear anywhere because you're going to get really good tan lines with this one. I wore this one to tan the other day, actually. This is what the back of it looks like. 
I remember a long time ago, I saw a girl with a bikini that looked almost exactly like this. And I loved it, like I loved it on her and I really wanted it and I couldn't find it anywhere. And this probably isn't the exact same one, but it's very similar. I'm very happy I found this one. Again, it's got the little whatchamacall. And I really like how the top is twisted. Like, it's just one twist in the middle to kind of make that bralette shape. And these bottoms to me look more V-cut. And that's my favorite. So I think these are my favorite bottoms out of all the bottoms. And if you're wondering, they did send me these bikinis, but I'm not sponsored. Like, they're not paying me or anything. I always give my 110% honest review, and I probably won't do a sponsor if I really don't like the product. So I'm just being honest with how I really feel about these bikinis. I can't get the pepper thing out of my head, though, every time I see the color. <laughs> Man, I really wanted to film this video outside so you could really see in the sunlight and everything how it looks but it's just not sunny enough today it's super cloudy to be honest either way though i think you guys got a really good idea for these bikinis okay guys so that was the whole bikini try on bikini lookbook whatever i name it i really hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as i did like i was literally looking forward to filming this video and i'm really glad i found black belt because these are going to be the bikinis i wear every summer from here on out but I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you want to. Don't forget to tell me which ones were your favorite and what you liked or didn't like about the bikinis. I love you guys so much. Thank you for clicking on this video and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye guys.